Hi, it's Kelly here, and in this video I want to share with you an absolutely free method, a technique. It's, it takes one second to do so that you will forever get over your procrastination for writing any books that you might want to write. One book, ten books, whatever. It works every single time, and it takes one second to do it. In fact, I did it with this book. This is a 350-page book, and I completed the first draft in 30 days or a month. Um, and, uh, you know, it's a complicated subject, and I got it done. And it doesn't, the book doesn't suck either. In fact, it was uh, listed on Amazon, the number one mover and shaker uh, out of 10 million titles that Amazon offers. And 25 years in, in print, and it's now, it's still selling. I had a couple orders earlier today for, for this book. So this method works. I'm also the author of this book. Uh, in fact, I uh, recommend it highly. It's, uh, of course, is there a question that heals instantly? And it will dramatically change your life. So let's get started. So let's say uh, you're stuck on your book. And I'm going to give you different examples, different scenarios. You're stuck on your book in, uh, at some point. All you do if you're already stuck, is you go back and read a few paragraphs where you're stuck, and then erase the part of the last sentence of your book of that of where you're stuck. And you're not going to write today. You're just going to erase that part of that sentence. You're going to go to bed, and you can wake up in the morning, and you're going to want to get right back to it as soon as you can. And if you can't, because if you have other commitments, you will get back to it with your first opportunity, and you will write again, and then at the end of that day, you'll also erase part of the last sentence, and you just continue doing that until you get to the end of your manuscript. It's that simple. Now, if you are having a book in mind, but you haven't been able to start on it, for example, you would do a similar thing. You would pick that one thing about the book that drove you first, ah, oh, I'm going to write that, I'm going to write a book about that, and you write a sentence about it and it can be it doesn't have to be a great sentence it can be lousy and you might decide you know to explain a little bit right a couple more sentences this is true for a novel or i mean nonfiction. you know if, it, if it's a novel you might just write an image whatever it was you see in your mind's eye write that there and then erase part of the last sentence once again it will pull you back to write that book and however many more books you have to write whether it's 10 books, 20 books, 30 books, you use the same technique and you never get stuck. And it doesn't matter if you erased all three of the sentences that you wrote originally. That's not the point. The point is that you, you got started and got you, got you there. So um, if that works for you, I hope you share this. And, and also mostly, you know, if you want to say thank you, you can get a copy of this book, which I, this is the one I recommend you, you get first. Is there a question that heals instantly? Um, or this book, The Doctor Who Cures Cancer. They're all available on Amazon. This is in three versions, including audio. There's a soft cover and Kindle. And um, by the way, I want to show you, give you some evidence that this works. By showing you something that looks silly, I'm going to show you my hands. Now, you see my hands? How old do my hands look? Do you see any liver spots? Well, I'm going to be 71. Or, excuse me, I'm already 71. I'm going to be 72 in less than two months. So apparently this works. Is there, is there a question that heals instantly? And in addition to the question, I also describe my invent, some of my inventions that you can assemble yourself to benefit yourself in, in miraculous ways. So if, if you want to say thank you, you can get one or both of these books. You know, it's not for me to say how you do that. Anyway, you take care and God bless. And if you if you like it, share this. That'd be great. Take care. Bye bye.